All right, Coach, first we'll start off a uh, question from Anna Jane Hal KNOE. Uh, How do you feel about what you saw on the mound tonight? I was really excited, uh, especially with Cam just getting started and um, felt like the energy was really good by him and filling up the strike zone. A little disappointed with the hit batsman, um, but it was nice to get those five new arms out there and um, just kind of get their feet wet a little bit and uh, excited about what we have with, with some of those guys um, with some spins and some velocity and things. But uh, Cam definitely got us started and uh, that, that was encouraging to see. Just to be able to get a win tonight, how does that help set up things just to maybe Take some pressure off. Just get these guys ready to roll for now. Series baseball this weekend. Yeah, I think I think our guys have been focused. Um, you know, I know everybody keeps talking about last year and all that stuff. I don't really. To me, that's over. It's just like anything. Um, you can't you can't just pick up where you left off. But um, with all the new guys that we have to to have the old guys kind of show them the way it was really neat tonight. And um, I think it I think it just kind of gave them a little bit of confidence as well. But uh, you know we expect to win every game, and um, we're we're gonna you know try to work our tails off to do that, and um, that's what we did tonight. Got after it offensively, Mason Holt the early home run, and then Beasley the hustle double, and, and the offense goes to work behind him to bring him home. Just what you see offensively, Mike? It seemed like those guys just got guys on and moved them over, took advantage of some situations. Well, I think Coach Collins did a great job of having some scouting report stuff together. Um, you know, we, we got to some hanging breaking balls that that we kind of sat on a little bit. Um, that's what Mason hit out, and um, and then uh, Shoals hit a ball hard later on as well. Worm hit one in, into a into a gap. He doesn't get a whole lot of doubles like that, <laughs> but. Uh, uh, I thought I thought our approaches were really good. I think those guys were just so excited to finally get out there and, um, and 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 be able to compete against somebody else. Just how much was that tonight too? About you had to cancel this weekend series. Just how much were they just ready to get out there and get after it tonight? Yeah, I think we were really disappointed that we weren't able to play. I mean, it was frustrating. Uh, everybody else around the country was kind of playing, especially in the South. Uh, it's unfortunate, you know. There's can't control the weather, can't control umpires a little bit, but. Uh, um, our guys worked extremely hard on, uh, you know, Saturday and or Friday and Saturday to try to get the field playable, um, but just with that that snow thawing and everything, so they were disappointed. Uh, Monday's practice was just okay, and um, but I think they were ready to come out, and that that's just a sign of a mature team, you know, with all the older guys that we have. I know we're limited in how many folks we can have here, but it seemed like a great crowd tonight, and to have the smoke over the outfield and just. The atmosphere felt like it was there a little bit. How much did you guys feel that on the field? That that's that's what this place to me is all about. Um, the the fan support has been tremendous in the last year, um, and then to, to have them out here tonight, to have the college students out there on the deck, and and uh, you know razzing the left fielder a little bit was was really neat. And uh, yeah, like to see that smoke. There's something about college baseball when you can do that. And uh, you know Jamie Crowley down there cooking for our guys. Um, you know after the game is really neat and. Uh, we, we expect it, and, and I think we've got a good product that people can come out here and watch, uh, you know, some good baseball. What are you looking for this weekend in New Orleans? Uh, you know, just a first road trip. It would be the first road trip for a lot of our, you know, especially the new pitchers. Um, and then series baseball. You know, how do you win a series and how do you win a series on the road? With with us having 28, uh, you know, games on the road, we got more road games than we do home games. So we got to learn how to win on the road. Uh, you know, you get the first at-bat, but you also got to get that last out, too.